All right, the Nike sale just launched, and in this video, we're gonna be trying to find as much profitable product that as possible that we can buy for really cheap on Nike.com and then flip on Amazon for more. Let's get right into it. So right here, we're on the Nike website, and we're just gonna go and see the sale. So save up to 60%, and then with code ultimate, you can get 20% off on certain styles. So we're just gonna hit shop and start looking at some shoes, because that's really what I like selling. So we're gonna go into the shoes category, and then we're gonna sort by, let's see what brands we got. So there's all sorts of different types of shoes. We can sort by, let's do featured and see what's going on. All right, that pulls up the same results. But we can start just looking through. Uh, I wanna see if I can filter a little bit more. Yeah, let's filter by Jordans. All right, so this is really gonna help us out here. So Jordans, at a discount, usually you do pretty well on Amazon. So we're gonna open up this tab and see if any of these are in stock. Okay, so a lot of these are actually in stock. So we're gonna go and get the style code. We're gonna to go to Amazon and then we're gonna paste it in the search bar. So what this style code is, is it's the unique code that ties like, it's basically the barcode of the shoe, right? So. We're gonna try to see if we can find those on Amazon um, and see if they're added to Amazon at all yet. They might not even be added. That's kind of the dicey part too, is like you have to find the shoes that are actually added onto Amazon and uh, sometimes they're not added, added on right away. So we're gonna look under variations and see if we can find the shoe. gold so we have similar results but looks like it looks like it's not on this amazon listing so we're going to move on but yeah there's just so many different colors on this listing but that could be could i'm going to go into keep a product finder really quick and see if we can search it We're gonna do search, and then I'm just gonna do a style code and see if uh, see if it comes up in here. Um, all right, sometimes that works, but in this case it didn't. This one's probably really brand new. Um, so these other colors could be good too, but I'm pretty sure they're new and it's not added to Amazon. But we can try to put the style code in. See if we find it. Okay, we found one that's amazing so let's look at the different sizes that are available so we're going to be getting this for 110 dollars but then we're going to be getting it 20 percent off because we're going to use that code so if you got our trusty dusty calculator out here 110 times 0.8 that's a 20 percent off discount so we're getting these for 88 dollars and then let's go to here, so we're getting those for 88. The current buy box for size seven and a half is at 139.95. So nothing too crazy, pretty small ROI on shoes. Uh, yeah, this listing's pretty new. That's what I was ta talking about, about the other one, this one. This looks like an amazing shoe, but it doesn't appear that the Amazon listing is on Amazon just yet. But when this gets added, this is probably gonna be a really good product. Um, but we can just kind of look at these new listings. So when I look at a no new listing on Amazon, I really take the data with a grain of salt because there's not gonna be too much data that Keepa has extracted off of this listing yet to put it lightly. Like it hasn't gathered too much data. So you might see that like, oh, in the offers it says it sells zero, but this is more than likely wrong because the, uh, you know, the data is pretty fresh. So we can see this person, they sold one, this person sold one, this person sold one at 150 bucks, so that's really interesting. Uh, this person sold one at $200, so they hopped on pretty early. And then it looks like three people sold size seven and a half, and that's in stock. And then there's all these other sizes in stock too. I wanna keep on going. I don't wanna just spend the whole video on just this one shoe, but that's kinda how I look at the Jordans. So we'll take the Jordans off now. But y'all can look at all the other Jordan shoes, and there's probably some really good stuff. Um, but let's just kind of scroll through some other other shoes so you guys can see kind of just how I look at shoes in general during the Nike sale. 
So we're just going to go on and look at some of these 270s. They're pretty discounted. These Air Force Ones are really discounted. And if you guys aren't familiar with all the names yet, that's completely fine. Um, you'll get used to it, especially the more that you sort of shoes. So we're just kind of looking for something that I think looks pretty discounted. Uh, these might be good too. Let's look at let's look at those. Why not? Think these are really cheap. I'm just kind of clicking on ones that I think might be good. Usually, what you're looking for is just something where the color is super clean, and uh, you know, it moves on Amazon pretty well. So these might be good too. Dang, these, someone they could they cooked these for sure. Um, we're just gonna keep keep on looking. Let's look at the ones that we currently pulled up. So we got these two seventies. Looks like you know if you hit the sale right away, you could have purchased all the other sizes. I bet these do pretty well on Amazon. That's why they're out of stock. So people hit it hard when the sale was early. Um, okay, it looks like only size 11's on Amazon right now, so that's that's a pass. Let's see if any of the other ones are discounted. Dang, these were only a hundred. Yeah, so these were out of stock. These are out of stock now, but if you uh, hopped on the sale early, you could have probably made a bag on those. Yeah, they're doing pretty all right on Amazon. Let's see. Yeah, like 168. Uh, it's out of stock now for that size, but you would be getting these for 80 and then you're selling it for 168. That's pretty crazy. Uh, so we have these Air Force Ones, which isn't the best looking colorway, but we can look it up on Amazon so we find something good. So it looks like just that one listing. This might be a newer listing, so only size 7.5 getting these for well, we could just put in the seller amp calculator and let it do the work for us so we put this number in and then scroll down to where's the discount scroll down to oh there we go 20 percent so then it says we're gonna make 31 dollars on this and it looks like a few people sold them so this might not be terrible yeah you can see several people sold one Almost 130, 130. Somebody sold for 200, 200. So kind of interesting, right? Um, nothing too crazy here, but maybe a few bucks to be made. All right, so we're gonna move on. Uh, these are actually more of a kid shoe because they're seven Y. Uh, they're youth size. So we gotta make sure we account for that. Uh, all right, this is a match. It says big kid shoe and then Let's see size seven Whoops size seven So size 799 all right, all right, now let's see how much it's going for 64 97 and then you have the discount on top of that So let's bring up the calculator Always just bring up the calculator 64 97 times 0.8 because it's that 20% discount and then we're gonna put that in here Then you know nothing too crazy, but some a uh, little bit of money to be made on that shoe too Just kind of showing you guys how I uh, Source some of these shoes and we'll look at like one more shoe and then we'll continue. We'll uh You know, let's see size 11 Okay, yeah, this is what I love to see on Nike and this is a big nugget, especially for the people that have stayed in the video And uh, I do that in a lot of my videos. I'll give out the real good stuff at the end um, So just a few left is what I really like to see on Nike That means that a lot of people are taking the stock and once the item sold out usually the resell value of the item uh, Does pretty well on Amazon. So I really like to spend a lot of money especially when it says there's just a few left because I like to take stock on, um, you know, shoes where it says that. Because then I'll be able to basically take stock on the shoe and then nobody else is going to be able to compete with me because I took all the stock. Um, hopefully that, uh, that makes sense. Let's 
get this. So let's get the calculator out. It's going to be 178, 97 times 0.8. So you're getting these for 143. Uh, what size was that? Size 11. So it doesn't look like size 11 is good right now. Um, but if you guys hit the sale early, a lot of the other sizes might be a little bit more promising. But we're just going to move on. Uh, let's see if any of these other ones. Oh, wow. These are so cheap. You're getting these for, what, 100, 100 and something? Let's see. Those are super cheap. That's the thing, too, is like... Especially when you're scrolling, don't just like look at the one. Look at all the other shoes on that listing too. On uh, like the Nike page, right? Like if one Vapor Vapor Max is on sale, like look at all the others. Uh, let's see. So let's get the style code. Put into Amazon. Put that sucker into Amazon. Yeah, another thing that I like to do too is just like kind of click and see if any of them are low in stock. So five and a half slow in stock. Not always the ones that are low in stock are like really good, but like some really good ones are low in stock sometimes. Uh, so we're gonna continue on. Size 11, 164. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do that. Uh, so let's see, 134, 97, and we got that 20% discount. So we're, yeah, we're getting these for 107. 11's in stock. Yeah, a lot of these are in stock. See the five's not here. Let's try 11 and a half. Oh, 11 and a half's out of stock. This is kind of what I was talking about. The ones that are out of stock are usually a little bit better. Um, Size 10, size 10 is not terrible. Let's see, 26% ROI. So this isn't the worst thing in the world, um, but you also have to factor in, we are getting cash back when we're checking out these shoes and you could use gift cards to save a little bit of money too. So. Thank you for watching the video, really appreciate it. If you want more sourcing videos like this, definitely consider subscribing. Appreciate it, bye-bye.